Last night I was at a healing event. It was a beautiful time. I had the best time with all the people there. So I, ha I had different people coming up to me who've been to some of my other events last night. And a couple of people came up to me and they both shared with me that since I prayed for them, they had cancer healings. Um, one woman had what we call peritoneal cancer. It's stage four, it's the worst, the absolute worst you can have because it's the most aggressive stage. And then the peritoneum is the cavity within your body that's kind of like the pelvic and abdominal cavity. And what's sitting in there is um, your intestines, your bladder, they're all kind of pushing out into the peritoneum if you're a woman, the ovaries, the uterus, I mean everything's kind of poking into the perineum and that's the surface tissue. It's called in the medical field epithelial tissue. And when cancer arises from there, it literally grows into your body. And it's a horrible cancer. It can make you swell up like a balloon where you're just filled with, with water and a lot of cancer cells. It's a really bad news cancer. And I was so happy for this woman. She said she had a wonderful healing from something that's completely from the enemy. Horrible cancer and not a very common cancer. It's actually really quite rare not like lung cancer or breast cancer or colon cancer. So I was so happy that she had this wonderful healing. And another woman um, had had a cancer that was a superficial cancer on the skin, more the skin area and you know maybe inside as well in the lining. But it was covering her nose. Just remember cancer can be on any part of your face and head. You can get what we call squamous cell cancer, you can get basilar cancer, you can get malignant melanoma, which is really the worst of all. That's like the most horrible one because it's really aggressive and, and it's very dangerous. It was wonderful because she said she had had a healing as well. She was very excited. I'd seen them both about a month earlier and they were um, sharing about this wonderful healing of the Lord. And I'm getting testimonies every time I'm doing ministry of people being healed right on the spot, people that I prayed for. Um, God's healed them. It's just a beautiful thing for me to witness because I love people being freed from these horrible illnesses. So let Lord, I just pray that you give everybody the healthiest and best genetic material that they could ever have and that they're blessed with health, good health, great health, wonderful health, and that they feel their best. They feel wonderful, wonderful, wonderful in the Lord. I pray that for each and every one of you that you are literally thriving and everything is set right so that your genetic material is a blessing upon you. No problems, no weaknesses, no nothing that shouldn't be there. So I pray this in the name of the Lord for each and every one of you. So I love you all. It's great to be with you. Blessings from God. In Jesus' name, amen. Lots of love.